If you are looking to generate SVG code from text or images, then maybe have a look at this new model called as Omni SVG. In this video, we are going to install this Omni SVG on our local system and we will check out how to generate this SVG code. This is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel as that helps a lot. SVG or Scalable Vector Graphics is a widely adopted image format in graphic design that offers resolution independence, compact file sizes and inherent editability. Unlike raster images, SVG maintains high precision and consistent visual quality across varying resolutions by using geometric primitives like Bezier curves and polygons. This format has become a cornerstone of modern digital design, being extensively used in professional workflows from UI UX design to industrial CAD systems due to its ability to enable precise manipulation while maintaining quality at any scale. This model Omni SVG is a unified framework that uses pre-trained vision language models from end-to-end -end multimodal SVG generation. The model addresses limitations of existing methods by parameterizing SVG commands and coordinates into discrete tokens which decouples structural logic from low-level geometry. I will be talking more about its architecture and stuff but for now, let's get it installed. I am going to use this Ubuntu system. I have one GPU card NVIDIA RTX A6000 with 48 GB of VRAM. I am creating this virtual environment and while that happens, let me also introduce you to mass compute if you are looking to rent a gpu or vm on very very affordable price you can find the link to mass compute in video description with a discount coupon code of 50 percent for range of gpus and now let's install the git repo of this project and i will drop the link to it in video description once that's done all you need to do is to install the requirements and these requirements are going to take a couple of minutes so let's wait while that happens let me introduce you to the sponsors of the video who are iGent which is the world's first multi-agent workforce desktop application empowering you to build manage and deploy a custom AI workforce that can turn your most complex workflows into automated tasks and you will find their link in video's description all the prerequisites are done and now let's launch our demo with python app.py and the first time when we run it it downloads the model so let's wait for the model to get downloaded and meanwhile let's talk a bit more about the architecture so this omni svg builds upon pre-trained vision language models and uses a tokenization approach where svg coordinates and commands are converted into discrete tokens this design separates a high level structural understanding from geometric details allowing for more efficient training while maintaining expressiveness for complex SVG structures. The model is designed for professional SVG design workflows and can generate content across diverse domains including icons, detailed illustrations and enemy character design. It also supports multimodal instructions making it quite suitable for various creative applications where high quality editable vector graphics are needed. The system particularly excels at creating complex layered SVG structures with rich color semantics that traditional methods struggle to produce. So let's wait for this model to get fully downloaded and loaded onto our GPU. And you can see that for the vision language model, it is using Quens 2.5 VL 3 billion, which is a very performant model that we already have covered on the channel. If you're interested, just go to the, the channel and search for it. And meanwhile, if you are there, please also like this video and subscribe to the channel as that helps a lot. Thank you for all the support. Let's wait for this model to get downloaded. And the model is downloaded. Let's access it on port 7860. And there you go. So Omni SVG is now running. You can create image to SVG and text to SVG. Let's try out for with image to SVG. I'm just going to select one of uh, the examples. So let's go with the scorpion. I believe it's a scorpion. Let's click on generate SVG and that 
while it runs let's check out the vram consumption in real time so it is consuming just touch over 16 gig of vram not bad okay let's wait for it to finish generating and then we will check out what sort of svg code it generates and this is the output which this model has created so this output represents a vector graphic drawing created by this model uh, if you look here what is happening i'll just quickly scroll up to show you i'm going to copy this i'm going to paste it in this online svg viewer i'll just okay let me enter here sorry let me reload this thing okay now let me paste it there you go you see this is the svg uh, image and the code works properly well we just tested it now if you look at this output this primarily contains a 200 by 200 pixel canvas and contains three distinct path elements and maybe more um, so these paths basically um, use bezier curves and line commands like m for move c for curve l for line to define the shapes and each path has full opacity and uses the even odd fill rule and these are the svd stuff if you are into this field you would understand what i'm saying but the point which i'm trying to make is that the output is very accurate not only in terms of this but we also tested it out here okay for text to svg maybe i'll just say a colorful ice cream pop side with hint of chocolate let's check it out and this should be fun let's wait for it to get generated and takes a bit of a time too by the way it's not as quick so i have seen for the image to svg it has it has taken around 40 to 50 seconds and i will tell you when this finishes so it finished in front of you there you go so svg preview is also there if you want to again verify it just copy it go to any online or any svg viewer paste it there there you go how good that looks really really good stuff okay let's try out one more so for instance i want to create a company logo so i'm just going to paste my own so you see i'm asking you to create me a minimalist company logo svg with a blue circular background white geometric mountain peaks in the center and the text summit tech below in clean sans serif font I'm not sure if it can write the text or not but let's check it out we will see in a bit and there you go it has completely messed it up the rest of the stuff is fine i think it can't uh, write the text okay that is fine next up i'm asking it to generate me an svg icon set for a mobile banking app wallet credit card money transfer arrow and all that stuff let's see okay let me it's not showing me here let me go here and then paste it here nope it doesn't show me anything so i will maybe this is where it is failing i'll just remove this and regenerate it and there you go much better than before but still can be improved in my opinion anyway let me know what do you think about omni svg and if you are into this svg image generation please try it out and share your thoughts please like the video and subscribe as it helps a lot thank you very much